Today I'm going to tell you about my documentary that I created. Um, the documentary is about the DACA, uh, Deferred Action of Childhood Arrivals. Uh, it gives kids who were brought over by their parents, maybe illegally or legal at first, that gives them the opportunity to just be able to work and get a good education and drive and stuff like that. So what inspired me was a lot of my close friends were in this program and as I saw it kind of um, end when Trump came to, as when Trump became a president, I was, I really didn't want them to see them leave because they mean so much to me. So I decided I'd create a documentary about that and see if I could put my opinion out there to change some minds. So in the beginning, I start out with a, um, with kids saying the Pledge of Allegiance. Now, when you get to high school, you don't usually say the Pledge of Allegiance anymore, but I thought this was really important because it kind of represents how we all came together and, like, fought for something that we really wanted. And I just loved starting with this because, like, at a long, young age, we, we learn what we are as Americans, and uh, my point to get across was that we shouldn't lose that. Um, the scene was... Uh, towards the end, it was like more of a dramatic scene. I really wanted to show that like it's like really heartbreaking to see that these kids have a chance of going back to a place that they've never even like known. And so like I kind of made it like really dramatic to show like these kids might leave and we might not see them again. Like it's really heartbreaking to me because again, like I had some really close friends that just were affected by this and I don't want to see them go. Uh, towards, so towards the end, the dreamer I did a did the documentary about. Um, I kind of put in, I put him in some like some of the times where he's just having a great time, and like I feel like we're so fortunate to have these amazing students a part of our lives, and I really wanted like this documentary to kind of pull at your heart a little bit to like understand like what this program was and what it does for us as a country and like all the new things we learned about each other because of this and it's just I hope that people can watch this documentary and, and be like like understand why they are here and what got them here and like what situations they're in and and to maybe change your mind a little bit of how you see them um this was one of the shots in I had at the beginning um it was just kind of a shot of all the flags I went to one of our local colleges and they just in their cafeteria you know they had every flag of who has been um there at their college before and like it just amazes me to see how many how many different people from like different countries came here to like get an education like they might have not been part of the DACA program exactly but like they did travel from other countries and that's just amazing to me because like the culture from different countries is just beautiful um as you've probably noticed during a lot of this we did have a lot of driving scenes and that was mostly because my the dreamer that I was um, filming had loved driving. He loves driving. Um, so I try to show that, like, and, and driving is beautiful. So driving around, you just see so much. And I did so many driving shots just to, just to show what, like, what he loves to do. And, I mean, can relate to, like, what everyone loves to do. Maybe not drive, but, like, it was just kind of part of the documentary to show like what he sees and like the beauty he sees and all of this and and here is my beginning how I introduced my title it was kind of a build up to to show like what we are as America and then it led into what's going on now so this was kind of like another driving scene you know um, and to show what, what we're going to talk about, and I, I had fun filming this, but it didn't really hit me in the feels a little bit too, so, um, 
I hope that it really does make you guys think because this is a really serious subject and I hope that you look at this and like realize that these people aren't just objects that can be thrown back into a country that they've never even known. I they're people too. They have same intentions intentions as we do and they love the same things and they have a big heart and like determined to work hard and these DACA students tr work so hard to get where they're at and I don't think we should just abandon them to a country that they don't even know about. But I hope you guys enjoyed this film. I know I did and um, 